mga attention natin and the people in the house. Today, tagagawa tayo na isang chocolate cake pero it's not an ordinary chocolate cake but it's vegan chocolate cake. Okay. So itong vegan chocolate cake na to, there's no egg and there is no milk. So in short, it's dairy free. But without further ado, today gagawa tayo ng vegan chocolate cake na for but first, shout out muna doon sa nagpadala, okay, from Paris, France. And I love Paris. Actually, nasuot ko na to sa previous vlog ko. Itong April na to, but now, susuotin ko ulit yung aking second apron. Ayan na, may tag pa siya ito yung apron niya. Ayan. So, may tag pa yan, guys, ha? Bagong bago. From Paris. Okay. So, ito mga guys. Mga attention natin sa people in the house. mag start na tayo. So, we need sugar. Two cups of sugar. One and three-fourth cups of all-purpose flour. Three-fourth cups of cacao. So, baking powder. Three, three, three teaspoon. Baking soda. Three teaspoon. One teaspoon salt. Then, oil. 3 fourths cup, 1 cup of hot water, 1 cup of coffee. Kaprihit ang ating oven sa 160 degrees Celsius or maybe 350 degrees Fahrenheit. <laughs> Para sigurado guys, okay? So ito nga, sa recipe, ito nga kakuha tayo ng dalawang pan ng 8 inches, okay? Or tatlong pan, 4 hour, 6 inches pan. Okay. Also, Pwede natin gamitin ito as cupcakes. Okay? So sa recipe ito, makakuha tayo ng approximately na 2 dozen of regular cupcakes. It's eggless, um, daily free. So gagawin ngayon natin, nakapihit na yung oven, nakaready natin yung pan. Okay? Imimix-mix na natin. Okay, kung wala kayong stand mixer na tulad ng gagamitin ko, Okay? Pag medyo tinatamad kayo, pwede gamitin yung stand mixer or pwede tayo mag-manual mixing. Pero ang una natin gagawin is maghalo-haluin natin ang ating mga dry ingredients. The rules ng baking, lahat ng dry ingredients kailangan natin isip. Okay? Nasa sa inyo kung pwede nyo isip or pwede nyo siyang i-mix. Yan hindi naman yun. No. Pwede pa rin siyang gamitin ng wire whip. So nasa depende sa inyo kung gagawin nyo hand mixer, stand mixer, or manual. Walang problema doon. Okay? So, mix-mix ko nyo. Oh, meron pa akong nakatag pa. Para to make it sure, okay, lahat ng mga dry ingredients is paghahalo-haloin natin. After that, yung mga wet ingredients. So, ito na guys. Lahat ng mga dry ingredients. Yung flour, sugar, cacao. Ayan. Baking powder, baking soda, at salt. Ayan siya. We're going to put the oil in the hot coffee or brewed coffee. As manually mixed. Ayan. Pero tinatamad tayo guys. So meron man tayong mixer. May natin gamitan ng mixer. Papakagira pa tayo. Okay.
dalawang pan. So, nilagyan natin ng ayan, parchment paper. So, nilagyan na natin yung chocolate, vegan chocolate mix natin. Okay. Then, ilalagyan na natin sa oven. Okay. Now, nasa loob na siya ng oven, okay, at 160 degrees Celsius. Uh, in Fahrenheit, convert na lang natin. I-google na lang natin siya. 30 minutes to 45 minutes ang baking time niya. So, ito na siya. Mainit. Wala na siya. It's clean. Ready. This also. Ta-da! Nag-bounce pa siya. Iba pala. So, mostly, yan, nag-bounce pa siya. Pero, hindi siya tulad yung regular uh, cakes natin na nag-bounce pa. Okay? Just to make sure lang na, ano, tuto na siya. Yun, tutbi. Then, the technique is Minatap ko siya Ibabaw niya Maging flat So, wala masasayang na Na ano Na cake Okay So, palamigin lang natin siya Nang Let's say mga 2 hours Okay So, after that Siyempre, kung may vegan chocolate cake Dapat mayroong vegan uh, Chocolate frosting So, dairy free din siya Okay Using yes, yes, yes. So instead of butter gagamitin natin, we're going to use uh, vegetable shortening. So yung vegetable shortening, it's made from vegetable. Yata. Anyway, so after a few hours na na palamigin natin yung ating vegan chocolate cake, chocolate cake gagawa tayo ng vegan uh, chocolate frosting. Okay. Then after that, we're going to decorate our chocolate vegan.